today is my, you know, cut my hair, clean myself up kind of day. But I figured we can still start the morning off with a pretty view. So we're going to see some hoodoos. <laughs> Hello. And that is why this is called Toadstool's Hoodoo's Hike, which is quite a mouthful, but it's because of the rock formations that kind of look like toadstools, kind of look like something else, but we're not going to go into it. Uh, in a couple weeks, I'm going to be going to Goblin Valley State Park, and then you guys will, uh, see some true dicks. <laughs> I'm sorry. That was inappropriate. I'm so sorry. It's family friendly. Tell me they don't look a little fake. I mean, I know they're not. Well, I hope they're not fake, but they look a little fake. fun um uh, i'm gonna uh, i'm gonna go now and i there's a free campsite close by hopefully it's empty so i can cut my hair shower make coffee and enjoy my day whoops we have my fancy scissors that my mom got me. They're technically fabric scissors, but they're really nice. And they'll cut my hair. I don't know, what brand is that? Is that a good brand? Let me know. <laughs> Some of y'all who clicked on this video probably thought, oh, she's going to get her hair professionally cut. No. <laughs> I got, I have gotten one professional haircut in my entire life when I was in seventh grade, and it was the worst experience of my life. So I've never gone back and I just cut it myself. So this is my hair now. That. Yeah, that's pretty good. <laughs> oh my God. And that is how to cut your hair. <laughs> I don't know what it is about that feeling of just cutting off, like, I don't know, seven inches of hair that just, it feels so impulsive, but it's so freeing. <laughs> I mean, I don't, don't do it at home if you, you know, I'd love to have someone to like tell me the back is even because I don't know. How do we feel about the hair guys? I know it's dirty, but I think once I wash it and clean it up a little bit, you know, summer's right around the corner. Y'all already know it, boil water add it to water, dump it on my head. Because the Planet Fitness, so I used to love this area because there was a Planet Fitness in St. George, Utah, which was like a really good like central location for, for Zion and for everything else, but that closed down. So there's just no Planet Fitnesses in Southern Utah at all anymore. So yeah, we're going on, you know, a couple weeks without a shower probably gonna be a couple more weeks till I get a real shower. <laughs> it is a struggle. I'm genuinely thinking of changing gym memberships because Planet Fitness has just become way too unreliable. So if you guys want to let me know your favorite gym, if you travel or if you have a favorite, preferably 24-hour gym. I know Anytime Fitness, 24-hour fitness, places like that, but maybe if I could get one that wasn't 40 plus dollars a month, that would be great. <laughs> Ooh. 
One down, one to go. I always do this and I, like this is where I like run down my propane. So if I have like propane containers that are like, I think are almost empty, but I'm not sure, I'll just keep using them to heat the water for my shower because that way I know they're completely empty. I run them completely dry. And then I don't have to do that when I'm in the middle of cooking because that's just annoying. I think you can hear the propane dying. Sorry if stuff like this isn't what you clicked on to see, but it is, you know, realistic. I'm never gonna claim that this is like a glamorous lifestyle. But it's fun. <laughs> If you're the type of person who feels the need to shower every day, it's probably not for you. Shower time! Okay, give me a second. <laughs> and I'm clean. I have to cut my bags too. All right, I cleaned it up a little bit. How do we feel about it? Because honestly, I, I'm a fan. Ah, I think it looks really good. I think I did a pretty good job. I mean, it's not even, and I'm sure any of you are hairdressers it's, could use some work, but you know, I am happy with it. When I was a young boy, my father I also made dinner with my <laughs> with my impromptu concert. <laughs> Y'all ever just feel like sometimes that emo 2000s vibe? Damn classics is what those are. That might be the most fun I've had making dinner in a while. <laughs> Pita pocket with cheese and tomato and onions. Dipped in soup. Sorry, it's a little windy, so the hair is getting in my face. See you guys for sunset. I mean, I'm gonna, do I have soup on my mouth? Sorry. I'm gonna be here for sunset. Um, but yeah, I think I'm gonna sleep here. Well, anyways, see you for sun, sorry, the feel, <laughs> see you for sunset. I don't even know.
the sun is setting. <laughs> and it is getting cold and I'm gonna go put pants on. I was on the phone with my mom. She always likes to call me and say, I'm going to bed, I can't talk. And then we proceed to talk for an hour and a half. <laughs> oh man. Yep. See, everyone says these are so cool to have. And then you hit them and then they fall down. <laughs> I really, I really need to get this new reflector. Like it would take such a short amount of time for me to fix my problems. <laughs> But I've been saying that since I started this channel, so I would rather live with them. Because why fix the problem when you can deal with it and find a way to half-ass manage it? And in your brain, you've decided that, well, it's good enough. <laughs> All right. Welcome. Come to my bedroom. I gotta stop. Oh, this feels so weird. My hair hasn't been this short in years. <laughs> I feel like I have no hair. I know that my hair is not that short, but it feels so fucking short. Y'all are curious. I know I never sleep this direction. My head is always down there, but um, <laughs> this is gonna sound really weird. So basically I have cell service here and I don't have cell service in the back of my car. Um, sometimes with putting up the reflectors and stuff, the service just gets astronomically worse, but because this specific window doesn't technically have a reflector yet, uh, it works. So if I lay here, I have three bars of 4G, and if I lay that way, I have no service. So I'm laying here so I can watch some YouTube. <laughs> the things you do. <laughs> but yeah, I think I'm just going to end the video here. Uh, this was just chaos. This video was just very chaotic. <laughs> uh, yeah. It was honestly such a good day. <laughs> I know I didn't do that much, but I love a good free campsite. I love when nobody's around and I can just shower and do my shit and hang out and walk around. Just such a good day. <laughs> Sorry for the chaos. Thank you for um, sticking with me and putting up with me. <laughs> Because sometimes I feel like I'm actually talking to people. I guess I, I feel like I'm talking to people now. Because I have like, I don't know, people that I feel like I know who watch my videos. So I feel like I'm talking to a friend now and I'm not just talking to a camera, which is really fun. I need to stop laughing. I need to go to bed. I only smoked a little bit of weed. <laughs> okay. Um. Thank you guys for watching. And I will see y'all in the next one. <laughs>